the Metropolitan Museum of Art, and we're looking at one of the great paintings from the early Hudson River School, Thomas Cole, The Oxbow. And it's a very large landscape looking down over a bend in the Connecticut River. In uh, Northampton, Massachusetts. And we have this canvas that's divided in two, really. One with the sun emerging, looks like a storm is passing. That's right. On so on the, right, the left, there's this incredible kind of... Dramatic sky violent with rain. Almost. And, and actually, you can always make out a bit of lightning yeah. out in the extreme and left. And there's that cracked branch and the foreground. That's right, the blasted bow, right? right the blasted the tree. tree. Right. And, and in fact, this painting painting is all, often seen in American art as a sort of wonderful expression of the two ways that landscape were understood, as the pastoral tradition mm -hmm. on the right and as this sublime expression on the left. Right. right? Cole himself up in the foreground. Looking shown, back at us. Looking yeah. back at us and he's painting this beautiful American landscape. And, and of course that's what America had. Europe had ruins and churches and uh, great monuments and history, but America had these fabulously beautiful, untouched landscapes. Which although, were really made noble and made into a kind of mythology. And also feed into ideas of manifest destiny. and That's right, of America's divine promise. Right. Here I think we have some signs of man in the landscape, not just the pure, untouched landscape. So it's landscape. complicated, because it is this kind of is the complicated. beginning of the American Industrial Revolution. Right. And you can, you're right, you can see, especially on the right side, Division of land into farmland. and The you know, exhaust of, right. of houses or perhaps, Chimneys. that's right. Um, and so this is a settled area. And so there's a kind of question about which is the direction of America. Right. Yeah, I this think it's, sort of growth of man settling the landscape and But does and that technology. destroy, in a sense, America's greatness? Does it destroy the wildness and the pristine beauty and uh, sublime expression of God's presence? Because remember, if you look at the left side of the canvas, mm -hmm. with all the power of that thunderstorm, of that blasted tree, of the wildness, what, what this was understood in the 19th century really is an expression of God's sort of immediate presence. Mm -hmm. And is, is God being somehow erased in some way? Or is the settlement of America, of the United States, and a man settling the land, is this part of God's plan? And for, that for really us? is the central question in the first half of the, of the 19th century in America. Mm -hmm. it, is a, it really speaks to this very complex relationship that exists between these new Americans and their world, their landscape. Yep.